Call of Duty 4 Modern Warfare. One word. Big. No, not the campaign. That's short. Um, lifetime in your Xbox. That's pretty big. That's, what, that's not what I'm talking about. What I'm talking about is it's a big game. Worldwide, thousands of people selling it. Uh, selling it and buying it. And um, loads of people enjoying it. Loads of people think it's really revolutionary in gaming. Like, instead of World War Two, I was the same. I was like, World War Two being uh, Germany and all different countries. They decided to go modern. So I decided to review it. This has been my latest, but my latest game that I bought and my latest game that I've completed. I bought it on Saturday there, completed it on Sunday. Very short game, but it's a really good game, so it's worth reviewing. So it's my introduction. And I'm going to review Call of Duty 4, Modern Warfare. I'm giving you your this one, you know. Before we get into any gameplay, there's one thing that we must always do. Insert the disc, of course. And then you go. Well, did I mention this is this will be the last review that I'll do that I won't be writing a script for? So, for my next, for my reviews from now on, I'll be writing scripts for, which is pretty cool. I won't be stuttering halfway through, thinking of what to say next, and which is pretty not embarrassing, but it's embarrassing when you don't know what to say next. But anyway, here's the game. It was developed by Infinity Ward and Infinity Ward and published by Activision, who is a really good company, both really good companies. And I think Infinity Ward all they've been doing is Call of Duty games. So as you can see, at the start of the game there's a nice wee intro about Pact for the Story. Destroy Okay, so menu. The menu is uh, good. It's simple. The uh, Modern Warfare 2, which I'm saving up for, and um, that menu looks even simpler. So this menu is simple enough and it's easy to do. You've got resume game at the top, and um, as composed it, new game, which is like an arcade ar and arcade mode. And <coughs> um, so I'll be looking at arcade mode later on, and down the bottom's like. Um, more like just like Xbox Live stuff, like more player stuff. Although I do not have Xbox Live yet, um, after I get Modern Warfare 2, I'll probably get um, Xbox Live. But so, first of all, I'll get into gameplay, see how the gra graphics are, and stuff like that. So, may as well do the first mission now. Okay. Try, try not to die. So, in Call of Duty, you play as a uh, British, which I'm playing now, so, ca uh, Sergeant Soap McTavish, I think, and he plays American Sergeant Jackson, Sergeant Jackson, yeah, that's his name. Um, but you mostly play, like, after a couple of missions, something happens, and you play more, you play it all as the British. I don't like spoil, it's pretty um, good, but that's spoiler. Well, it's not good, but you understand what I mean. <coughs> So, right, right. So here we are. We're doing the tutorial menu. As you can see, you press the controls first. Are uh, LT to aim. The right uh, RT to shoot. So, um, you press left bumper to throw a uh, flashbang, but you go. You usually front a room. That's for uh, right bumper is for. Grenades, A is to jump, B is to crouch, and if you hold it and you'll go down like that. Y is to swap weapon, I don't have any other weapon now. Uh, X is to reload. So, uh, the controls are perfect, I think. Uh, well, pretty much perfect, it's perfect, you can get them. Um, next up, I'll just get some shooting, show what the shooting's like. Now, aim your rifle down range. Now, shoot each time, aiming down the sights. People. Okay, mate, one more time while aiming down your sights. I, I just messed up the controls, but uh, people say people say that. 
Um, Eamon's off. I think Eamon's perfect. Look, I think it's absolutely perfect. So I think that Eamon is perfect, and um, it's absolutely fine. So yeah, the bullets are pretty strong. They can, as Gaz was saying, you can shoot through. Um, the material which comes handy later in later on in the game. The graphics which are amazing I think. Well not amazing but they're really really good. Um it looks really nice the the gun um, design is nice um well, I think they're improved it in Modern Warfare 2. The graphics is amazing, and I think it was voted best graphics of the year, which when it was out, um, really nice. I really like it. Um, the textures on the the textures on like surfaces like this are really nice, nice and polished. And one thing that I especially like is you can see part particles in the air, um, which is nice. Um, as <coughs> more realistic to it. Is always faster than reloading. Right, and the, so, come this way. the voice acting is really good. Your knife is even faster than to your Although uh, the voice, the, the voice lifting, lifting, limping, not limping, what? You know what I mean? Um, miming. No, not exactly miming, nice. but you know what I mean. It's I don't think it. I think it's not that good. I mean, their mouth is not moving, and it, it is moving actually, but it's not like producing the worst like. Um, if you know what I mean, it's like it's hard to explain. But I wouldn't say the voice, the, the lips, when you see the words are um, that good. But the voice acting is really good, especially when we get to the more dram dramatic scenes. <coughs> and you press. Oh, I forgot to mention. You press L. What? Um, hold in. You want to move, and you'll run, and the right one to stab or use your knife. So, in this bit I'll show, it will show you some grenades and uh, flashbacks. So, um, I'll just stop it here and go into arcade mode now.